pick a language? Um, let me see. Can we do German? Very well, we shall do German. Do you want to do the one about the cold, hailing, windy night or dancing and jumping? The dancey jumping one is kind of hokey, but the but the, the know, cold night is, like is pretty. Polar opposite. I know. <laughs> Let's go hokey. Let's go hokey. Let's go hokey. Tanzen und springen, singen und klingen. Falla la la, falla la la la, falla. Tanzen und springen, singen und klingen. Falla la la, falla la 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 la. Tanzen und springen, singen und klingen. Falla la la. Thank you. I got the high note. Oh, that was beautiful. I Thank love it. Nervous. And who art thou? I am the Foxy Bard. And I'm Twig. Well, thank thee so much. That was thank beautiful. Thank you very much, Rilard. Good day, lords and ladies. My name be Nathan. And mine be Haley. And we are at New Crossford, which is the location of the New Jersey Renaissance Fair. Mm -hmm. This is our first time visiting any other fair besides the PA Ren Fair, and we are super excited to be here. Yeah. So, what do we have on our plans for the day? Okay, so we want to see Jacques de Whipper. Of course, yes. And Adamo and Barty Party. Yeah, Barty Party. 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 Yes. Let's do Barty Party. Yes. Yeah. So, we are planning on seeing a lot of different shows because yeah. there are a lot of different performers here than what we normally see at PA. Mm -hmm. So we're excited to see them. And I think first up is actually Jacques Z. Whipper. Yeah, I think so. Which I'm super excited for because I came across him on Instagram and just started falling in love with his little videos he was putting up. Yeah, yeah. And I've been definitely. wanting to see him for like the last year. Oh, definitely. And then when I saw he was on the performer list for New Jersey, I was like, yes, we definitely have to go. Yeah. So, enjoy a little bit of Jacques C. Whipper. Well, folks, as I said, my name is Jacques C. Whipper. I am French. That is an excuse for anything that may go wrong in this show. I trip over my words. I am French. I stumble all on this stage. I am French. My microphone intermittently gives out. <laughs> the batteries are French. All right, so, I'm going to try and angle myself this way so that the wind isn't quite as bad. That means, folks, I'm not going to be playing to you as much, but it also means you guys have the best view in the house. And you'll be <laughs> sorry. sorry. <laughs> Here we go. They tell me not to sing, but that's my thing, so everybody let's get Sing it, we will with you. Audience, sing it. <laughs> Alright, uh, someone over on this side. Renegade. Renegade? By six. It's the song. <laughs> <laughs> My Little Pony! <laughs> welcome to Doolock! Wait, welcome to what? Welcome to Doolock. Welcome to Doolock? <laughs> Shrek! Why do I know that? Where did that from? Shrek. It's from Shrek? Shrek. Oh, God. <laughs> Welcome to the show where I crack my whip. There's a shark back there. He is gonna strip. He is gonna steal him. Those creatures don't come again. Every winter. I'm gonna do something a little more up close and personal. We have here, ladies and gentlemen, a bull whip target, and we are going to place that bull whip target in a place where no man should go. Oh. Now, audience, some of you can see some of the pitfalls involved in this trick. We know how that song goes. All right, folks, so let's do something dangerous. Let's do something dumb. Let's try this.
that was Joxy Whipper, which was so much fun. Yeah. And he ended with fire, which is a fitting, I don't know. Segway. Segway, thank you. Segway. Uh, into our next show that we're going to see, which is at the same stage, the chessboard. That is Adamo Ignis. Lords and ladies, it is that time. So let me tell you about Adamo Ignis. It means to love fire. It means to love flame. That name is Latin. It is time for me to set myself on fire for your amusement. Are you ready? Then we're going to start, as promised, with some skin on fire. I'm going to begin with this hand right here. Extra danger, windy edition. Here we go. Lords and ladies, they are real. They are sharp. And right now, they have a protective covering on the edge of the blade so I can hold it in my hands. And do this. I have three more blades. I will remove the covering, <laughs> revealing the sharp, exposed edges. I need a number between one and four. Call it out. Yeah. All right, my bell. Three is. All right, three. Adamo Ignis. My word, that was very entertaining. Yeah, it's been a long time since we saw her, and we saw her at PA, um, but I totally forgot anything that she did, so that was really nice to see it again, as well as probably updated tricks, I would assume. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah, because it's yeah. been a few years since we actually watched her show. Yeah, uh, she did great. Really good, really good. Now, so we don't just continue to bore you with show after show after show. They're not boring. They're, they're, not, they're not boring. <laughs> I'm but, just kidding. But from like a, a watching the, on YouTube standpoint, it yeah. gets old after seeing like sure show does. after show after show. We're actually going to walk around and check out some of the shops because there are a lot of shops here, a lot of great artisans, yeah. and we would like to show you some of those. Yeah. So let's go shopping. Tomboy Togs' pins are everywhere. Everywhere we go, we see them. So we found a little corner of Middle Earth with Galadriel's looking table, and the hobbit doors, and the prancing pony, and then Haley. In my glory. Yes. I love this. So this is at Sprightly Shelters. All right, now it's time to stop at Tatterdemalion. 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 Wait, hey, can somebody in here tell me how to say the name of your shop? Tatterdemalion. Tatterdemalion. It means ragamuffin. Oh, that's beautiful. I like it. I cannot say it. I just tried like five times. Tatterdemalion. Tatterdemalion. There you go. Thank you. All right, Haley is right here. She is shopping because she loves this place. I do. I do very much. Yeah. We saw them one time at the PA fair and loved it, so we chased them to Jersey. Which they told us the Jersey Fair is the start of their season. So if we wanted to find like a big spread of everything that's possible that you could buy, this would be the fair to come to. When they were at the PA Fair, it was at the end of their season and they didn't have as much selection left over. So we are excited to look through this tent and see if there's anything that we want to buy. Finding anything cool? 
I see a lot of things. Oh, okay. They're just like really neat patterns yeah. on this fabric. Yeah, they are. Things you normally don't see other places, especially not on the Amazon. Are you sporting some of their clothes, sir? My lord, Tatterdemelian, they clothe me. They clothe when you. When I have a moment of fashion degradation, <laughs> I go to one temple. It's called Tatterdemelian. And they always have something new, something vibrant, something filled with joy and passion. Oh, yes. Well, it's a good thing we're here then. Yeah, I want passion and joy. <laughs> Wait, isn't that why you married me? Yeah. Yeah, that's it. Yeah. Because <laughs> you would lead her to places of passion and joy. Passion and joy. Like, like here. Perfect. Wonderful. I'm okay. doing it. How we you friend. did it. Oh, I like this pattern. Oh, that is a pretty pattern. And these colors are so neat together. Yeah, they are. I think a lot of these are like men's outfits too. I mean, I would wear one of those. Yeah. yeah. So, these so, are bodices you were talking about? Some of them, yeah, yeah. These are very short ones, like cropped. Um, then they have longer ones that go like oh, full yeah. length of the torso. Oh, and then there's like these really long ones. Oh, like, yeah, like riding ones. Oh, I yeah. love these. Yeah, those are cool because they have like the flares on the bottom. Yeah, this is definitely one of our favorite clothing places to check out when we're at the fairs. Oh my word, Haley, look how cute these things are. They are cute. And they're not screaming. Like, no. Cute. Oh wait, is that what they are? Mandrakes? Oh yeah, they are. That's so cool. I just like mesmerized by the cute. cute little eyes. <laughs> is it rare to have a quiet mandrake? Do you know? I mean, I'm pretty sure. Don't they always scream when they're, at least when they're young? Yeah. I forget the details. I don't know. These ones look happy. I know. The big eyes. So you can find these at Storybook Hollow, along with a lot of great other enchanted things like these little hangy light up fairy light things. And what are you looking at? Dragons. Oh, like dragons. dragons. Of course. Of course. Oh, they're turning the lantern lights on. That's yep. great. But they're solar. It's really hard to show them. Yeah. Look at the sunlight. I know. Yeah. That's so, but yeah, as, as soon as it gets dark, they start popping okay. on. Good indoor or outdoor all weather. I live yeah. in the Catskills. Been on all year round outside. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so I am here with Nick. You are one of the owners here. Yep. And he wants to tell all of you where to see their store, their shop, and uh, coming events because they're going to be coming to PA. When's that happening? So we have our next one in PA. We'll be at the PA Ren Fair. It's actually the Celtic Fling uh, in the end of June, I believe-ish. Um, and then we'll also be at the last two weekends of the PA Ren Fair, which is going to be Halloween and the weekend before. So Yeah, which Please. is where we've seen you before. Yep. And yeah, we got one of those little mushroom fairy lights for a friend. A she loved it. But yeah, we just love all the little crafts you guys have here. So if you're not coming to Jersey, definitely find them at PA if you're going to Celtic Fling or showing up at the end of the season this year. Thank you. Yes, please do. Yeah. We look forward to seeing everyone. Thank you. Free whip lessons. The lessons are free. The experience is priceless. Purchase not necessary, but highly encouraged. And you can also purchase whips, correct? Yes. That's the purchase of which I speak. Yes, yes. Oh, okay. I wasn't sure if like, you know, putting a tip in was like part of the purchase. Oh, no, 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 not at all. That is uh, that is based entirely upon your generosity if you feel like we earned it. Well, we appreciate your generosity for <laughs> teaching this. Thank you so much. <laughs> so, we have wandered our way over to the far corner of the fair, and we are going to try whip cracking. Are you going to try it? I don't know. Oh, yes, absolutely. I'm going to try it at least. I always get nervous in front of people. But you're used to being in front of the camera. It's, it's different. different. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm at least gonna try it if yeah. she doesn't. Yeah. So I don't know. I've always wanted to try whipping a whipping a crack. No, I don't think so. <laughs> cracking a whip. Yeah. I've always wanted to try cracking a whip. So Learn this is a good a time to try. Ah. All right, and go ahead in. Yeah. Yeah. Good. We don't want anything. Hang down this side, move this slide around your back. Yes, I can. Yeah, you just want a smooth line down that side. Yeah, there we go. So you look really attractive right now, right? You do. You're like a. a Everybody looks hotter with a whip in You're like a woodworking whipper. <laughs> All right, low price. So here we go. $50 or $50. All right, so it's Good. And then starting position is just right beside the box. Okay, no tension. Don't want to hold it out like this. Nice and easy. Up, and then down with a flick. So way back over your shoulder, and then a flick on the way down. Watch me for two. Here's one. Up. And out. Up. And out. Here we go. Okay. Try to stand behind her back. Yeah! There we go. Nice. Now, face the camera. There we go. Always find your camera. Important life lesson. 
Sooner. Go sooner. Nice. It's all a timing game. Nice, nice. Here we go. Woo! Yeah. 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 <laughs> he just called me daddy. Uh -huh. I feel like you should take a whip home with you. Excellent job. I think so, I might. too. I might. We've thought about it, actually. Right? Okay. I convinced her to do it. Here we go. Up, down with the throw to the front. It's a throwing motion. Like you're up a stick, throwing the stick. Here's one more. Up and out. Shot. I love it. Big wind up over your shoulder. Good. Oh, getting there. So here what we can do, your elbow's kind of coming out a little bit. You want this to happen in a nice narrow lane. You don't want a lot of left and right forward. So you want the arm to swing up, elbow, or shoulder, elbow, wrist in line. Up and down. Way back, way back. There we go. A little bit more. Way better. Better. Keep going. There we go. Nice one, nice one. Let's try a few more. Good. Big swing. Nice and straight. Yeah, yeah. Good. good. That was a good crack. Two more. Way back, way back. Good. Last one. Big swing. Yeah. Strong finish. Thank you. Strong. Now you got to take one home. I mean, come on. I know, I know. Oh, that I did was fun. It. I was brave. Yes, I talked you into it. <laughs> I, I succumb to peer pressure really easily. <laughs> yeah. Which and is it, not good. And it's something you wanted to do for a it very is. long time. Well, see, I wanted to do it, but I don't want to do it in front of people. Um, I want to do it in my backyard. <laughs> and then when you feel no good one. about doing it, then you do it. In then front of I'll get on the stage. Yeah. 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 But, but that was so much fun. It was fun. That was super uh, neat because he really yeah. helped you understand what you were supposed to be doing with your arm and your wrist and everything. Yeah. Um, there's a lot more that goes into it than I would have like thought. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> so it's, so, it's just quite a skill, sorry. I was gonna say, look for these people. Look for them if you come yeah. to the Jersey Fair yeah. or if you go to any other fairs. They are the only ones that they said they've come across yeah. in the fair circuit that do this sort of thing where they'll teach you how to crack a whip. Yeah. And they said that today they got a four-year-old to crack the whip. That's pretty good. So we are actually coming back the very last day of the fair this year, and we are going to be bringing your daughter. Oh, man. And I, I told them, I told them if you can get my three-year-old to crack a whip, that I would uh, buy a whip from them. And they said challenge accepted. So, yeah, if, if that happens, it will be, like, on our Instagram yeah. as a reel or here on YouTube as a short. So... Yeah, look for that. Yay, it's the pin lady. Hello, hello. It is Tomboy Togs. You are like at every fair we go to. I am. <laughs> like yes. always, she makes our pins. Phenomenal pins. Right there, she's carrying yeah. one. And she is selling them while she's here at the New Jersey Fair. I am. But you're only here for the first two weeks. Only for the first two weeks. Okay. I do have other commitments for their last weekend. Yeah, because um, they're scheduling issues that they had with uh, finding a venue and all that kind of stuff. Exactly. Yeah, made it where they had to push the last weekend, another week into June, made it yeah. tough for you. It did, I had other, I have a very full June, so yes. it just, yeah. Well, Haley, who is actually right back here, Hi. there you are. <laughs> we are both grateful for you always making our oh, pins. Thank you. And she makes phenomenal stuff. We have tons of her pins already. Every time we see her, we usually collect another one or two. Uh, so maybe we'll buy one today. All right. Um, I love that. I love that for us. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> but you need to find her walking the streets. Though, if you are coming on the very last weekend of this fair yes. in 2023, our pins will be sold at Chimes and Charms, yes. which we will show you where that is a little bit later in this vlog. Yes. But... Emily, thank you so much. You're very welcome. Yeah. You're very welcome. Thank you. Yeah, right? we love working with you. You're a great artist to work with. Oh, thank you. So. You're great bloggers to work with. <laughs> Do you work with other vloggers? I don't. Oh, well, that's... that's. <laughs> <laughs> so you're my favorite to work with. <laughs> Woohoo! All right. Well, thank you so much. Thank you. Here's Chimes and Charms. Uh, this is their tent. It is just over from the chessboard, which is right there. You come down this way. Or you come through this way, and then you come in here and you buy stuff from them. Like our pins on the very last weekend of the Renaissance Fair here in New Jersey. Hello. You're carrying our pins the last weekend. I am doing that. Thank you so much. You're most welcome. Absolutely. 
It's so big and spacious in here. It is because we have sold out of most of the stuff. Oh, well, wow. that's a good thing. Uh, yes. It has, yes. So we'll you're have more stock next week and the following and all that. You're going to have a busy week, yes. Monday through Friday. We're all making products. Uh, all the artists are busy. Oh, very nice. Yeah. All of them. But we are familiar with your product yes. because we are from the PA Fair. Yes, we are. You know how much we love bards that are in parties? We sure do. We, yeah, because, I mean, there's a two-bard party that you see a lot on the show, or channel, I should say. But now, we're going to see Party Party. Party Party! Yeah! We were asked to come check out their show and give them a review. So, also, we want you to review them in the comments down below. Let us know what you think, and we'll pass that on to the act. Yeah! So, enjoy the show! Now, my lords and my ladies!
Well, you're just humming the music, so that means you oh, must have yeah. really enjoyed it. Yeah, I think I really did. I loved their harmonies. Yeah. They're beautiful. And their fun, like, upbeat songs were really catchy. Yeah, yeah. I really enjoyed it. We hope you enjoyed Barty Party. So, I loved it. if you ever have a chance to see Barty Party, do that. And again, leave your comments down below on what you thought of their show. Now, granted, we only showed you maybe half of it. And that's just one of the many different shows that yeah. they put on. Yeah. So, right. you know, just keep that in mind when leaving comments. So. Yeah, and you can also find them online, Facebook and uh, Instagram and all that. So. TikTok, they said. Yeah, YouTube. so YouTube. So, you know, yeah. definitely look for them if yes. you want to see more. Yes, exactly. So, I think now we are going to try to find some food. And then we're going to end the day with a joust. Yeah. Because I'm really excited. Are you really excited to see the joust? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. It'll be really neat because it'll be like new jousting nights that we haven't seen before. Yes. I'm so excited. Yes. It is Round Table yeah. that is here for the first two weekends. And that is run and operated by Sir Ulrich, who you would have seen in the Zenkai Khan panel, panel yeah. that we did just a couple months ago. Yeah. So if you haven't seen that video, check it out. Sir Ulrich is a lot of fun, and we look forward to seeing him on the joust field. Oh, yeah. Or the tilt yard, we the should call it. The tilt yard, I suppose. Apparently we've been calling it the wrong thing. Ah. I don't know. Anyway. I still don't know what a tilt yard is. <laughs> Anyone know? Please leave a comment down below. Yeah, thanks. All right, let's go find some food. It's too exciting. It's a celebrity. Enjoy the so we did it. We picked a food stand to wait in line for. It's the shortest it's line. It's the shortest line. It's Dave's Donut Bar. Yeah. <laughs> You know, maybe not the healthiest, but it's food, and we are hungry. And they look really good. They really so. do. Uh, do you know what flavor you're going to get? I really want s'mores. I'm pretty sure that's what I would vote for. Yeah, I might do, like, the like bacon maple. Okay. Oh, we're getting two? I, I figured. I'm oh, hungry. Okay. You're hungry. I figured we'd stand in line for something else at some point. Oh, it depends on the price. Yeah. Anyway, they all look really good. They do. So, um, yeah, now we just got to wait in this line right here. I don't see it. I take things very fast. Nathan! Yes, right here. Nope. Thank you. Yeah. All right. Uh, I put my hood up because it's sunny out and I forgot to put sunscreen on my face. So I'm trying to keep my forehead from burning. So if I look goofy right now with the hood up, I'm sorry. But since the last time the camera was on, Haley and I had a bit of a discussion and we decided we would divide and conquer and we would only order one dozen donuts. And we'd pick the s'mores because that's what Haley really wanted. So Haley went down into another food stand and stood in line and wait, 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 wait. What's this? What is this creature? What is this creature? It's a Tallulah. It's a Tallulah. Hello. Hello. <laughs> All right, I'm off to find Haley. Oh! She has uh, other food for us. Ooh, what's she getting? What did you uh, get? Well, uh, we got s'mores donuts, and oh we're God. going to get uh, wings. I think she got wings and corn nuggets. Whoa. That so, sounds amazing. It, it does. So that's where I'm off to now. Have fun. All right. Eat all the food, boys. Will do. Hey, can you do me a favor? Can you do me a favor? Can you take my hood off my head? Thank you. So much better. <laughs> Good. Thank you, Tallulah. I see. I see you're blocking the sun from your head yes. too. Yes, I am. Yeah. What were you doing it too? Yeah, I had my uh, cloak oh, put up. Yeah. yeah, they saw me with it up too. I don't know. But then Tallulah. Tallulah was really nice. Yeah. She actually helped take my hood off my head because I was holding the food and the camera. That's funny. And I, I couldn't do. All three things. Oh, well. Yes. You always need a woman around, don't you? <laughs> and I lost mine yeah. to a food stand. Yeah. I told them what's happening. I told them that we divided and conquered. And now you're eating your s'mores. You're eating the marshmallow. I just had a marshmallow. Yeah. Okay. Well, we'll eat one. Eat one while we're waiting. A marshmallow? No, no, no. A, a donut. Donut? Yeah. Might as well while we're waiting. All right. You know. look, look, I even got a marshmallow in there. Well, who? So? So, what do you think? That is quite good. All right, I'm gonna see if I can get. So what did, what did uh, do I want to get all of it. I want to get a marshmallow here and. It's really, really fluffy, but yeah. also crispy on the outside. Yeah. Really nice. So, those are really good. Ooh, yeah. Finger looking good. Mm. All right. Mm. When we get the other food, we'll tell you if that's good too. Corn nugget. Yes, please. 
Um, I, will, uh, yeah. I think we're going to eat everything before we actually go sit down. Yeah. Mm. That's sweet and tasty. We just had a happy accident. Don't run into anybody. No. Uh, yeah, they accidentally put fries in with our wings. Thinking we got a combo. Yeah. But we didn't get a combo. No. She said, just, just take it. <laughs> so... so that was nice. That was nice. So we got extra food, which is really, really nice and helpful. To the glory of Loki! To the glory of Loki! That's what I like about Red Fairs. You could just like join in. You could just join in on things and it doesn't really matter because it's like just fun. Because yep. it's like such great camaraderie. Camaraderie, yep. Yeah. Run into you, sorry. I know. This is really hard to like walk and vlog at the same time. I still haven't gotten this down, even yeah. though we've been doing this for like like six years now almost? Yeah, a while. Yeah. So, we're trying to find a place to sit that's shaded because the yeah. sun is very hot today. With the bleachers in the background. Oh, thank you. Are you... Oh, oh hello. Did it work? Hi. Okay, so, you know, nothing like the Renaissance Fair to say bleachers. Metal I know, bleachers. right? It's because this fair is being held at the Burlington County Fairgrounds this year because, well, they had like three venue changes for this year. It was a whole like crazy thing that crazy. the owners had to go through, but yeah, they, they made opened. it work. Yeah, yeah. So <laughs> anyway, we uh, we meant to tell you about the food. That's why we stopped to record here. So yeah, what'd you think of the food? I liked it. Um, I really actually really liked the barbecue honey bourbon flavor that we got on the wings. Yeah. That was good. Um, the corn nuggets, really like those. The fries, they're fine. Yeah. Um, but my favorite thing that we have had was definitely the donuts. Oh, yeah. The donuts was, were great. Yeah. I like those. Yeah. So uh, if you can, try to get the donuts. If you can, we heard the empanadas are phenomenal, but that is the longest line you can stand in here. Yeah. Yeah. Um, you got to get it like right away when yeah. you walk in. Breakfast Something. empanadas. Breakfast That's empanadas. what we recommend. Okay. So uh, I think the next thing would be a joust. Do you Hooray! know the steel? Maybe that's 
Well, that is it for us today at the New Jersey Renaissance Fair. This was a fantastic first outing here for us. It was. It was really nice. It was very hot, though. There wasn't a lot of shade. If you can look at our faces, we are quite red. We are. We forgot our sunblock. So bring sunblock. Yes. Always. 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 Which is a part of one of our most popular videos right now on our YouTube channel, Five Tips for a Better Ran Fair Experience. Maybe we should watch that before we go next time. <laughs> I know, right? I was thinking about that the whole day. I'm like, yeah. we told people, make sure to bring sunblock and yeah. wear it, and we totally forgot to do that. Yeah. Oh well. We survived. Yeah. We had fun. Mm -hmm. It was great to see different acts, look at different shops and vendors, and try different food. Yeah. And we look forward to actually coming back the very last weekend of the fair, the very last day of the fair, because there'll be a special surprise to any of our friends that are from PA. You're gonna be seeing some familiar knights gracing the tilt yard, a Sir Robert and a Sir Balin. And if you don't know who Sir Robert is, he actually was King Henry VIII for the last three years of the King Henry storyline at PA. Yeah, right. So it's gonna be fun to see those guys on horseback once again. Yeah going at each other. We're really looking forward to it. Yes. So, if you can make it out that last weekend, definitely do so. If you can make it out any of the days, this fair is a phenomenal fair, has a great charm, and uh, just great everything about it. So, that is it for us. That is it. I talk a lot. No, it's okay. You just look beautiful on the camera. But what do we need to tell the people before we sign off? If you like this video, Give us a, a thumbs up or a like on yeah, our work. Yeah, yeah. And then if you want to see videos of us in the future, make sure you ring the bell notification. Yes. Or click the bell notification thing so you get some notifications. <laughs> <laughs> click the bell icon so you get some notifications. You need to get more practice of this. Yeah, I don't do this ever. And subscribe to our yeah. channel if you haven't subscribed already. We are looking forward to the PA Fair. It's only a few months away, and you'll be getting more content from us regarding this type of, well, content. Yeah. So, yeah. that is it. Until next time. So long. Farewell. Namarie. Okay, hang on a second. I'm a little confused because we just walked out of the New Jersey Ren Fair. But, Mr. Nathan, what's happening here? Um, I'm, I guess I'm supporting the wrong fair today? Something. Was it like secret shirt underneath your other shirt or? No, this was just the uh, uh, hour and a half drive. I want to be comfy shirt. Oh, okay. So we're like going back to PA. So we're going to, you know, become Pennsylvanians again. I exactly. Guess. Yeah. Exactly. I'm going to traverse my way back to PA. Perfect.